A strange twist today in a story involving former Detroit City Council President Charles Pugh. One of Pugh's victims finds himself in trouble with the law. Seven investigator Ross Jones here now with details on that, Ross. Strange and sad, Stephen. We are not naming the young man because he is the victim of sexual grooming, but today he was accused of a sex crime himself. The young man who was groomed by then Detroit City Council President Charles Pugh was charged today with soliciting a prostitute in Florida, one of 39 men arrested in a prostitution sting in Polk County. Grady Judd is the sheriff there who announced the arrests in a press conference. The young man, now 22, was charged with solicitation and possession of marijuana and paraphernalia. As we first reported, he met Charles Pugh when he was 17 through the Charles Pugh Leadership Forum, a mentorship program at Detroit Public Schools. When the student turned 18, Pugh began pressuring him into performing sex acts on camera in exchange for money. In 2015, the young man successfully sued Pugh and Detroit Public Schools, alleging he was the victim of sexual harassment and battery and suffered emotional distress. When we think about 12% of individuals who themselves have a history of abuse are likely to go on and abuse others. Dr. Joel Young is a staff psychiatrist at William Beaumont Hospital. Victims of predators don't do well. They tend to have a higher rate of exploiting others and becoming involved in exploitive relationships. Today's news was devastating, but not totally unexpected to the young man's lawyer, Bill Sykley, who he spoke with by phone. None of this should be surprising to anyone, especially the way in which uh, this young man was treated and abused and taught uh, by Mr. Pugh. Uh, these are the kinds of things that he was told, demonstrated to, that adults were supposed to do. The young man was visiting Florida, but he still resides in Michigan. No word yet on when he's expected in court. I'm Ross Jones, 7 Action News. All right, Ross.